assembled it. It is easily sliding and adjustable. You don't actually take, you need to take off the muzzle brake in this case, but if you have a pre-existing holster, this is a Blackhawk holster, with um, some type of belt loop attachment, you can utilize the, the same platform with a pre-existing holster. So you're on duty or you have um, some type of carry where you're utilizing this on a belt, you want to transition this to to your purse you can actually mount this directly onto your purse or excuse me, onto your platform and then put it in your purse again if you have a firearm and you're working with this make sure it's unloaded this is the holster the blackhawk holster that we have designed for this model 42 and it's basically going to look like this when it's all done So what you can do here, what you want to do is first and foremost remove the firearm, take your bigger strap and run it through your belt loop, portion of your pre-existing holster, make sure that you have enough room on both sides, and then you're basically just going to run it through the platform itself. back, velcro it in nice and tight, be sure that this is actually where you want it, just hit, and this is how it's going to look. For added support, if you want, in this scenario, we've added the additional Two inch straps. You can actually feed these through for a little additional support. My recommendation in this case is to run it down as far as you can on the, towards the muzzle of the firearm. And then it would support the bottom or base of the firearm even more. Even if the, the exterior trigger guard is covered, our locking mechanism is covered, it can still be utilized through the elastic that we have. Again, putting it into the purse, it's the same method. We're going to find our the, puck, the spot that we want. We're going to loosen up our thumb bolts so that they're hand tightened and can, be, and can slide. We're going to mount this in. And if you need to, at some point, this is a flexible piece that will can actually flex to, to move into your purse. In this case, it's a nice wide opening. I'm going to slide this in just like I did originally, utilizing just the platform with the elastic band as the holster. I'm going to slide my first thumb bolt all the way towards the holster side and hand tighten. Second one, I'm going to slide all the way to the rear, do the same thing. Last thing that I'm going to do is make sure that the firearm can easily be drawn in and out of this purse. In this case, easily drawn. The benefit of using an external holster like this is that the ease of draw and also the return to the holster is assisted by the injection molded holster itself. The five inch per purse platform with the Glock Model 42 concealed carry.
Thank you.